This morning I went to the middle school for their Veterans Day annual breakfast celebration to help volunteer. And while we were there, I was reminded of every year how they set a table that is one chair around a round table and it's set for all of those soldiers that are missing or prisoners of war or not at the tables with their family who have been lost in war. And so this table represents and symbolizes those missing soldiers. Actually, that's very fitting because this week as we uh, prepare for All Saints Sunday, a question that sticks on many of our minds is who is missing from our own tables? Yeah. Uh, we mourn the passing of loved ones over the past year. We remember the saints who have gone before us, who have sat at our tables and made such an impressionable moment of our lives. And it draws us back to the scripture because Jesus says today in the Beatitudes, uh, blessed are those who mourn uh, for, theirs, for they will be comforted. And it's in that comfort that we take solace that God is there with us. I know. This morning as we sat around there and they were talking about the single person seated at that table to, to remember their solidarity and their aloneness, I thought, no, that's what this Christian message has. That's what Jesus comes to tell us is that we might feel alone or it might seem alone, but God comes to us. God brings Jesus to earth. And that's what this beatitude's all about, is that there are places that we feel hungry and thirsty. We feel alone. We feel mourning and grieving. But Christ enters in and gives us a new way to look at things and a new celebration and a hope that we can only find in Christ. And, and that's why we gather on this All Saints Sunday, because it's at... It's at God's table where we're reminded that while somebody may be missing from our own, we are always comforted by the fact that we are there at God's table together. Exactly. What a powerful thought when we're having that communion that all those ones that we're missing are standing right beside us, are there through the spirit and the love of God. So join us this Sunday and be with your loved ones at the great feast at the table as we remember and honor and we are comforted by Jesus's beautiful gift of the resurrection and life for us all. So come to God's table and celebrate the presence of our Lord Jesus Christ. We'll see you on Sunday. See you then.